We were young. We were always over at Kristen Dana's house. We always were playing Barbies and Matt was always like, oh my goodness, you guys fight all the time. You need to just cut that out. And he left us with these little tidbits of information. Like one day you guys are gonna be best friends and you're never gonna know that you had your best friend with you your entire life. So I am certainly glad that he was right. We kind of bonded over playing Super Nintendo together, and we had a lot of fun doing that. And I know when I would get to a hard part in the game, and I would fail, and I would die, I would just beat the crap out of him. So if there's anything about Dylan that you don't like, blame me. <laughs> so he's outgoing. I'm an introvert. He's an extrovert. He will go out and do whatever needs done, and isn't afraid to speak his mind. Uh, I'm pretty much the opposite, and it's something I've always admired about him. We are here on this day to give thanks for the love you have shared with these two individuals. We ask that you help Dylan and Ellen to always remember when they first met and the strong love that grew between them. To work that love into practical things so that nothing divides them. Please help them find words both kind and loving and hearts always ready to ask for forgiveness as well as be able to forgive. We put this marriage in your hands. Amen. For today, let there be only tears of joy and happiness. For today, let the love you feel for each other shine through. Celebrate coming together in front of family and friends. For today, savor it and remember the work you've done to make this day possible. For today, hold tight to this feeling of overwhelming devotion and love to each other. 
for today. Be bold in your I do's so everyone knows your commitment to each other. And for forever. Remember these pronouncements and let them carry through your marriage. Do you, Ellen, take Dylan to be your husband and other half? Do you, Dylan, take Ellen to be your wife and other half, to take care of her and cherish your relationship, to love him, to love her today, tomorrow, and forever, to always be open, honest, and faithful to him? Do you take her to be your wife? Do you take him to be your husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, in sickness and in health, in good times and in bad, for richer or poorer, keeping yourself unto him, keeping yourself unto her for as long as you both shall live? I do. I do. <laughs> and now I pronounce you husband and wife. Dylan, you may kiss your bride. coming out today and braving this treacherous weather out there. Eight years, in fact, leading up to this, so I think I waited a little too long. I wish I did it sooner, but I know I'm with the right one. She's amazing, and... Uh... <laughs> Eat, drink, and be merry. I'm gonna hand it off to my lovely wife here to say a few as well. 
thank you guys all for coming. You guys are each very important to both of us. We're so glad that you're here to celebrate and thank you for traveling from all over the country. Thank you guys so much and we want you to have the best time of your life, so. Dylan, we are so happy to have you in our family. We love you. We should all raise a glass and congratulations to Ellen and Dylan. <laughs> He's a very compassionate person, which I think is best exemplified by his care and love of animals. And I'm so happy to see that that eventually led to you meeting Ellen at the wilds. So when he first told me he was starting to see Ellen, I immediately did what people do nowadays and stalked her on Facebook to get to know a little bit about her. And what do I see but dozens of cat photos. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay, well, you know, she's got potential. Cats are pretty big on our side of the family, so. And of course, she came over and I met her, and that's when I really got to know her and her warmth and friendliness and how strong she is to be able to put Dylan in his place from time to time. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me be a part of your wedding. Um, thank you all for coming. I know it's like they said, it's been pretty treacherous the past couple of days, but I'm glad to see everyone make it. And I wish you a lifetime of love and happiness and more cat photos. <laughs> so if we could all just raise a glass. Cheers. You're the reason that I feel so strong